Boris Johnson is in hot water once again after messages between himself and Lord Brownlow, who paid for part of the infamous Downing Street flat refurbishment, were exposed. Who is Lord Brownlow? Here's how the Tory donor managed to afford the Prime Minister's renovation. Downing Street will likely be wishing for a calmer, more peaceful 2022 as last year the Prime Minister was rocked by a number of scandals that nearly saw him out of office. But just as the new year begins, Boris Johnson has found himself rocked by the revelation that he agreed to consider proposals for a new festival in private messages with a Tory donor who helped fund the redecoration of his Downing Street home. Lord Brownlow provided almost £60,000 to the Prime Minister and his wife Carrie Johnson for their £112,000 refurbishment project, which Mr Johnson originally claimed he had paid for personally. The Electoral Commission investigated the matter, which ruled in 2021 that the Tories had broken electoral laws, resulting in a £17,800 fine. A separate investigation by Mr Johnson's standards advisor Christopher Guite found he did not, deliberately mislead. But the Prime Minister is now facing renewed criticism after messages between Lord Brownlow and the Prime Minister were published on Thursday evening. WhatsApp messages show Mr. Johnson discussed the proposal for a new festival, proposed to be called the Great Exhibition 2.0, with Lord Brownlow at the same time as requesting his help with the £112,000 revamp of his official residence in Downing Street. The conversation led to a meeting between the peer and then Culture Secretary, Oliver Dowden. Downing Street said the proposal for Great Exhibition 2.0 was not taken forward. But the government is going ahead with Festival UK, which was first announced in 2018, later this year. The revealed exchange has forced the Prime Minister into providing a humble and sincere apology for failing to disclose the messages to Lord Guite at the time of the investigation.